Hi, it's Dan Seiler with the Lakata Group here at Keller Williams Capital Properties. Thanks for joining me on today's Market Minute. It's being brought to you from Poplar Hills, located in Stafford off of Brook Road, very close to the Brook Road VRE station, making this a out of the way secluded neighborhood, but with easy access to the Virginia Rail Express stop and access to downtown. So a very important thing is currently happening in the U.S. economy that we need to talk about, and that's the upheaval that is being caused by U.S. tariffs, and in turn, the trade war that seems to be ongoing with China, that no one seems to have any ideas to the extent or the length of that trade war. But what it is doing is it's affecting consumer behavior and it's affecting the climate in today's economy. But let me share with you some important statistics, and this is from the Home Expectations Survey done by Pulsomics, where several economists are polled with what they think is going to happen. Now, many of those anticipate a downturn in the economy, and we've all heard that in the news. But that same group of people are expecting price appreciation in the housing market regardless of what's going on in the global economy. Here's their projection for 2019, which is 4.1% to finish off the year, 2.8% the following year, and 2021, 2.5%, and 3% in 2022. Now, when you add that appreciation together with a mortgage interest deduction, this means your money is going to be so much more productive in the housing market building equity and building wealth in your home than it ever would be in a CD or a long-term uh, fund that would collect interest. So despite what you're hearing in the economy, the outlook for the housing market is now again situation normal. But two things are entering into the elements that are going to affect the housing market. And we both know what those are. Those are interest rates and housing inventory. Interest rates are going down and housing inventory hasn't significantly changed in the last three years. So demand for housing is going to remain somewhat strong regardless of what happens in the overall economy. So if you're delaying putting together an offer to purchase a home, I would suggest to you it's still a very good time to buy a home. And we're here to help you with that. You can reach us at the Lakata Group. You can friend us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel. But we're here to answer all your questions as professional real estate advisors. Thanks for tuning in. And we'll be back to you with another Market Minute in the next week or so. Take care.